All right, we're back with the Outer Worlds, and we're heading off for our reward for the space station Captain, and unload I'm all this stuff. Say, your thrilling management of the UDL troops at HRS-1084 was masterful to, um, remotely keep apprised of. All right, let's get our reward, unload all this stuff I've collected and has overloaded my character. Approved our request for docking, Captain. You're free to disembark. Um, let's see. Yeah, we'll just go with these guys. Been watching some interesting TV today. They had the, uh, oh my gosh, the World Series on from 1982. I think it's 82. The Cardinals versus the Milwaukee Brewers. It was not a good game for the Cardinals, but, you know, what you gonna do? Let's get rid of all this stuff. Alright, I'll pick this up once I've unloaded all this stuff. Alright, I've unloaded a lot of stuff, got rid of what we don't need, now let's go get our reward now that I can run! Run like the wind. Well, run anyways. More like a gantling antelope or so. Sways back and forth. And yep, this is sublight. Let's get our reward. See if she has another mission or something for us. A couple bucks. Stealing other people's stuff. Spaceships and whatnot. Finally, a base of our own. Soon we'll have eyes on every corner of the system. Well done, Captain. Uh, you'll also find some automech salvage awaiting your new owner. Well, let's ask about this weird scientist in the suspended tank, shall we? I heard about that. While my lawyers scratch their heads wondering how we deal with human salvage, I'm leaving the researchers in hibernation. Aside from the automated security, did you meet any resistance at the station? Yeah. The guy who turned the lights on. <sighs> I knew it. They've been shadowing us since Monarch. Maybe even longer. I've been less than honest with you. Really? Your Didn't assignments notice. weren't strictly about the salvage business. They might have figured that out already. Gee whiz, no, I just said that for my own. My own thoughts. Uh, yeah, cloak and dagger warning. That's right. Up until now, I've kept you in the dark for your protection, and more importantly, mine. But I'd like to think we've earned each other's trust. After the monarch job, I started connecting the dots. I didn't like the picture. Then what we found at Station 1084 confirmed my fears. You and I have stumbled onto something big. Something none of us were meant to know. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's bad news. Maybe the worst. Ask yourself why a skeleton crew was studying that Alta Vitae gas in secret. Ask yourself why stockpiles were hidden on a planet full of monsters. Yeah, I'm guessing you have an idea. Before we go any further, I want you to keep an open mind. Can you do that for me, Captain? Really? You're asking me to keep an open mind? This is better be good. Aliens. I'm talking about aliens. They're the ones responsible for the deaths at 1084. And who knows what else? We have to put a stop to it. Well, at least it's alien conspiracy in space. Let's say nothing. Hear me out. I'm saying it's aliens. I'm not asking you to like it. I'm not even asking you to believe it. But I need to act on this threat to the colony, and I can't do it alone. Well, at least she doesn't expect us to believe it. This doesn't feel at all right, Captain. The crew is skeptical. That's good. I don't want you walking into the unknown with blindfolds on. 
I assume you have questions. Nah, really? You think I have some questions? Let's skip to the part where I get paid. I don't care about the hallucinations. Hmm. You took that better than I thought. Dr. Chartrand is the crooked psychopath behind the gas experiments. She sold out her species. Now I need you to put a bullet through her skull. Hmm. Sounds messy. Straight to business, huh, Captain? This key card will get you through the front door of her Byzantium estate. Don't ask how I got it. You might not like the answer. By now, the other side knows what you're doing. Don't trust anything Chartrand says. She's compromised down to the bone. Maybe even deeper than that. All right, our employer's crazy. Well, at least that adds some spirit to the game, doesn't it? Let's see. Well, dialogue is uh, turning out to be more important than uh, most other things. That and lockpicks. Uh, let's go with lockpicks. I've left a few rooms behind that I'd like to have pick it, picked up. Yep. Perks. Let's see. What else can we add to the perk list? Uh, melee damage. Detection of enemies. That could be good. Uh, uh, carrying capacity. I could have used that this last time. Critical hits. Uh, after killing an enemy. Damage while health. Well, let's just go with the carry weight since I've obviously needed that the last time very badly. Alright, let's get out of here. And now we have an alien conspiracy and we're going to commit murder because of the alien conspiracy. My character is insane. Alright, let's see. What's the active quest? The City of the Stars. Uh, meet Phileas' Philly, contact. Acquire scent. There's weapon on the ground breaker. That's why I mentioned rumor of a ground breaker science. Scientist who bragged about a powerful weapon he was researching. Okay, so let's see if this is... On Hawthorne's... Okay, so where does it want us to go? All right, let's see what we can find. It's taking me back to my ship, isn't it? It sure is. It's just going to the ship. All right, well, we'll we may hunt down these science weapons or something. I have a feeling a science weapon is somehow on the... Uh, on that research lab and I don't we haven't been able to get into his office so that may be something we have to do later all right let's see where we're gonna go I believe I hear Felix and Parvati discussing the latest Aether wave serial Yes, they're talking about TV shows. Uh, no, we're not going to Phineas's lab, so let's see what's left. Because we've already been there. We've looked around there. It's not... That's not happening. Where do they want us to go for that? Let's see. I am... Oh. E, not M. Uh, Terra 2. All right. Uh... Let's see if we can find this. We are now in orbit above Byzantium, Captain. Um, let's see. The scientist and... Uh, let's take the animal hunter. Let's see if we can find this while we're here. Oh, wait. Uh, oh, we're Byzantium. Um, oh, 
These are not the two people I want to take. Let's try that again. We want the, the, the daughter, yes, and Bavardi, her, the engineer, because she's looking for clothes. That's, these are the two we want. The black and white's supposed to make it look like it's classical. Take a little spin around the dock before we head out. The last time I did this, there was nothing to find either, so. Could be just me wishful thinking on my part. Nothing here. Oh, hey. All right, first time searching, found something like that. Nice when that works out, my favorite. Sight, nothing there, nothing really useful. Cleared that out. Here they come. Whoa. I guess the troopers don't like me. I didn't know they were uh I guess the corporation don't like me much. Wow, is my reputation that bad? Well, I don't have to worry about stealing because you know what? They don't like me anyway. Wow. I didn't know my reputation was that bad, is it? Really? Our reputation. Ground barriers, positive. Auto class, very positive. Monarch. Positive sublight shipping eh, is kind of bad. The board, ooh, wow. The board don't like me. Uh, any Cleo, it's fine. Ooh, wow. The board's factory. Well, I, I did kill them all, so I guess, yeah. But the deserters like me, and Spacer's Choice, eh, just 50 50. And I shut their power off. <laughs> well, I guess I'm not liked. We're gonna deal with that. I guess this is gonna be a wonderful experience of them sh trying to shoot the heck out of me. Where is this? Oh, let's uh, open that up so that we can see F Phineas's uh, contact. Hey, I want that. Alrighty, well, let's see if we can't find Phineas's contact and deal with the other stuff. Oh wait, Phineas's contact's here. I thought they said it was in the ship dock. Do you mind? I'm meeting someone. Really? You're meeting something? Oh yeah, here. Sarcasm. I oh oh. You mean I'm supposed to be meeting you. <gasps> this is a bright one. Nothing, it's just I thought you'd be taller. Taller. Anyway, let's not get hung up on that. The Phoenix is a wanted man, and the board has eyes everywhere in Byzantium. Really? Wow. Yeah. You're looking to make contact with Minister... Uh, Magpie, right? I should warn you, it won't be easy. He spends most of his time in this estate, which is heavily guarded. Okay, so get me inside. Afraid not. He almost never leaves his home, and his guards never leave him. Can't say I blame him. It's scary out of doors. I mean, can you even count how many times we've been shot at? No, I what cannot. What specialists, huh? Our mutual friend is really branching out. Whoa, I'm not one of your B and E specialists. I just provide intelligence. That remains to be seen. <laughs> yeah, that's, I like that. That's debatable. Ha ha. <laughs> Some of the guards hang around Billingsley's house of inebriation between shifts. That place is still open? I used to study there during medical school. Maybe you could do some reconnaissance there. You know, swipe a key while nobody's looking. They're already shooting at me and I just got here. Just remember, you didn't hear it from me. Oh, like they'd care. How'd you get involved? I've always been fascinated by birds. 
If you ever research Earth species, there are thousands of them. So colorful and distinct. Here we got 11 flavors of terror rays and not much else. That kind of variety? I mean, gosh, seems almost impossible. The other thing about birds, though, is their environmental indicators. Yeah, they fly off. Exactly. I started thinking about everything we see around Halcyon and all the things we don't see. Like a what? For starters, you rarely come across anyone living in Byzantium who wasn't born here, even though we get ships in all the time. Trust me, anyone with a lick of sense gets out of here as soon as possible. But most people don't. In fact, most people stay exactly where they start. Doesn't that seem strange to you? Not really. And then there's the way nothing gets fixed. There used to be a suggestion box around here. People would drop ideas in. Nothing ever came of them, of course. Seems pretty normal. Sure, that part is. That's why they install shredders in those boxes, after all. But one day, the shredder broke. No one came to fix it. And since it wasn't working, we didn't have anywhere to file our complaints. So you can imagine how messy things got. I bet your repair folks couldn't find parts. Back in Edgewater, I'd have to take something apart just to put another thing back together. Might have been the paperwork. Here, you have to append forms to your forms, and law help you if there's a single dash out of place. And? At first, management put up an out-of-order sign, but that just seemed to worry people, like they were advertising something wasn't working. They eventually took the whole suggestion box sign down so that people didn't have any expectations about it. But they never fixed it, never replaced it. Doesn't that seem odd to you? Yeah, no, that's pretty much what goes on around there. Everything's broken and no one cares. No one wants to fix it because they don't want to work on it. Except that's not how they go. At least that's not how they're supposed to go in Byzantium. The whole episode made me wonder, if they can't fix something as simple as a suggestion box, what else aren't they fixing? Yeah. After a while, I got connected with our mutual friend and started using my position here to feed him information when I could. That's it, really. Alright, let's uh, move on. Alright, so we met with the, uh... Get the key from him. Alright, and then we got clothes that we need to get. Alright, let's get a move on. Moving on. Oh boy, they're already... Look at this. We already wanted and we, are, we just got here. Retiree, retiree, retiree. Retirees, I guess this is where the retired go. Let's see if we can't kill some people quietly. Bye. Come on, come out. There's more, and we took some a lot of shots there. Oh, all these people don't like me. Well, then I guess we're just gonna have to kill them all. Because I've got some. Oh. No, let's just keep using the light gun. Light ammo! Light ammo! Where are the rest of the people who don't like me? This looks like your retirement program. Because I need to wake up my character, my companion, and all you people having him scared keeps him dead. Doo -doo, doo -doo -doo. Uh. I 
There must be somebody else still alive around here. I have horrible aim. Is Ellie gonna wake up anytime soon? Oh, I'm still in battle mode. Who around here is still alive? Wake up. Retirees! I had to kill all those retirees. <sighs> Ellie, you awake now? There you go. Requires. Uh, great. It's still locked. Any of these people have what I'm looking for? Did not go as planned. I still can't unlock whatever that is. So we're gonna have to work out how to get this key. It's not laying around. Wait. It's laying around up there and I just missed it. Let's try again. Look around. Nothing laying around up here. Nothing in here. Oh, I can't reach that yet. Nothing in there. Possible. Well, that's not the code. All right, I guess I don't get the code. All righty, I guess we head back out. Hmm. Let's see if it's out this way. Oh, this door's not lit up though. Yep, uh, we can't get in there. All right, well, there's nothing else in here uh, we can get to, so I guess we go the other way. Do, 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 up the elevator. So we're already heavily wanted on this place. Not a good sign, not a good start. The rich people don't like us. Notice how this rich, fancy city has a very cheap elevator. Why can't something exciting happen around here for once? Nothing wrong with stability. It means everything's. Right. Oh, snotty people. Look at that! I've already got. Oh, wait. red lights go. Hey, you. Oh. Yeah, you. Want to be famous? All right, famous. Kid, you got presence, natural magnetism. Know what I mean? No. I like where this is going. Oh no. Whatever you're selling, I'm not buying. There's those street smarts. Just the right amount of rough around the edges. Next time, we'll have you say that over the rim of a trippist out. Product placement, baby. Listen, uh, you got an agent? Some kind of representation? No. I consider myself freelance. Fresh natural talent. I know it when I see it. Listen, you got a real special quality, raw energy. I see you in pictures, kid. Um, I'm in person. What do you offer? I'm making a feature, Space Pirates of Moros Prime. It's gonna be a hit. But we still need a star. And I think you got the chops. Ah, Captain! You're gonna be in pictures! Already got an entourage, huh? Way to get ahead oh, yes. of the game. So what do you say? You ready for the chance of a lifetime? Sure, give me money. Terrific. We're holding auditions at the studio. Head to Odeon Pictures and take the elevator. You're going all the way to the top, baby. Alrighty. You're gonna be big. Oh, that's the guy I was just talking to. Alright, uh, stole that without witnesses. 
Jan oh, that's where I walked from. So let's see where are we got. Whoa. Oh no. They're not shooting. All right. Let's not shoot first then. They must not know who we are. All right. Well, they didn't shoot at us. We'll take that for, that I guess, a good sign. A model of a system? Not super accurate. I once treated a lady who got her hand caught in the gears. Idiot was more worried about her rings than her fingers. The dissidents actually took over the refinery. Let's see. Uh, stairs and stairs. Maybe we can get there this way. What? What was that? Make him regret it. Oh, great. They're, now they're shooting at me already. Bye. Bye. Whoa, now who's shooting at me? Go away. Bad people. Wow, back up. Still under attack. They're still coming after us. Oh, who's she running after? Oh boy, there's a lot of red around here. Come on, Ellie, don't, don't do this. We can't kill them all, oh good. All right, let's wake up Pravati then. And if we go quiet, they won't look for us and Pravati will wake up. Otherwise, we got a lot more killing to do. There she is, she's awake. Guys need to heal up so that you know they take us again. We got a shot to you know survive a shot or two. Uh, what's in here? All right, they're close enough. They're on us. Oh. I can't even buy some simple weapons. <sighs> this is not good. I got the whole town against me. I can't take any of the weapons. Oh, I can take the grenade launcher. Oh, Ellie's down. It's wonderful. Oh, Ellie's awake again. Great, the whole town is trying to kill us. This is not going to go well. Walking to Oh, let's clear out. I can't buy from anyone. I won't be able to sell to anyone. Let's clear out some more of the stuff we don't want. Got one of those. Two forty-seven. Where's the other grenade launcher? Two forty-seven. No mods, no mods. Okay, okay. Keeping candy cane. It's just fun to say. I've got a candy cane weapon. All right. Uh, 14, don't care. 3, don't care. That's. A... No, I like my other hat better. All right, we'll keep all that. Sell the junk. 
And to get rid of this thing. All right, let's get out of here. More guns. They're all trying to kill me anyways. Uh, that's one of the rooms. Let's try this room. Okay, well, that didn't work well. This one killed me, so why won't this one? Aged whiskey. Right up my alley. All right, let's get out of here. Citizens, today marks a monumentous occasion in the course of Halcyon history. After a deep and thorough examination of our budgets, revenue streams, and predictive models, we are publishing our... That looks like a trooper. Yeah, corporate trooper. Bye-bye. another trooper down there yep that's a technician that's fine it's a sentinel that sounds like a trooper to me heavily armed technician all right heavily guarded but uh not that heavily got it. Alrighty. This town really ha does not like me. We got the key! Oh! We're disguised! Well, good. Let's move quickly. Get in here. Okay. Oh, shut up. You! You just slaughtered those guards, and for what? To speak with me? What could <laughs> possibly be so urgent? Well, I could have slaughtered the rest of your guards. Oh, my law. Captain! Captain! That's the minister! Mr. Clark! Oh, wow! So, this is one of the guys who runs the colony, huh? Small room for a big shot. If this is about another aether wave clip or radio spot, you may kindly fuck off, as the parlance goes. I'm not doing any more. Yeah, let's just cut to the chase, shall we? Drugs, of course. What else would it be? I don't have any drugs. You should try a vending machine or a purveyor of curative goods. He's got no idea what we're asking about. No kidding. Will that be all, then? Can I hit him? Uh, recordings, no, they're not drugs.
I'm not gonna ask why I keep telling like don't play games I like that oh dear I don't think I can say this any more slowly unless of course of course it's Rockwell again who else and I thought he was only holding me here to keep me out of the way all right back up oh you better start making sense real fast chairman Rockwell he's kept me under house arrest for years I've long suspected him of transacting business in my name, but this proves it. Yeah, sure. It's always someone else who ordered the hookers and energizing ointment. Please, this is important. Whatever it is that brought you here, Rockwell's the one behind it. Yeah, you expect me to believe that? Oh no, sure, I'm going to trust the Kibling Lunatic. Would you sooner trust an avaricious, mendacious profiteer? Or his horde of toadies and fools, perhaps? I am trying to help you. And here, you're going to need all the help you can get. Now. Whatever Rockwell's doing, he'll be doing it from the HHC headquarters. Your oh, best look, I'm gonna be able to, to get there. details in his office. This all feels off, Captain. Like, when there's a storm coming, but everything's quiet and still? Believe me, things have been off around here for a very, very long time. A reckoning is most certainly due. We really gonna do this? Getting involved is a messy business, and it rarely pays. This is about more than bits. This is about the survival of the colony. If you don't help, who will? Why, this is starting to sound like an issue of Dissident Hunter. Oh, good grief. These guys and their cereals. Yeah, you're a little too excited about all this. We're discussing industrial espionage, legal redress, the possible salvation of Halcyon. Is this not exhilarating? Also, this is the longest conversation I've had with someone else in quite some time. Let's focus back on how do I get into the headquarters. Via the Acropolis District, of course. That's where the most important corporate and government facilities are. But only board employees are allowed into the district. There's a heavily guarded checkpoint just down the street. There might be a route through the maintenance tunnels, but I'm afraid I don't know specifics. Most people avoid the area for obvious reasons. Okay, once I get into the Acropolis. When you reach the HHC building, this access card should get you up to the executive suites, where the chairman's office and what used to be my office are. What used to be your office? Oh, I haven't been allowed up there in years. I shudder to think what Rockwell's done with the place. A gilded minibar, perhaps? A personal theater? A man has too much money and too little sense. That sounds familiar. How'd you hang on to the access The board's lackeys are none too bright. I simply claimed I'd lost it and hid it somewhere no one would think to look. Ew. I merely hid it in a book. No one reads anything longer than a few pages around here. There are a few advantages to dealing with imbeciles. Yeah, I kind of noticed. Wait, Rockwell has one of the only terminals capable of transmitting to the earthbound message drone. This is our chance. Please, take this and transmit it from his office. Rockwell hasn't given me any messages from Earth for years. He's desperate to keep me out of contact with the Earth Directorate. But they need to know what's happening here. All right, what's on the cartridge? What isn't on it is the real question. I've gathered meeting minutes, internal messages, sustainability reports, and more, all exposing the corruption and mismanagement plaguing Halcyon. Once the rest of the Earth Directorate sees it, they'll have to send help. You're awful trusting for a guy who's been locked in his own house for years. The Earth Directorate is our best hope. Even Rockwell's resources are no match. And it is hardly in their interest to let Halcyon crash. All right, sounds idiotic, but how long will it take? Depending on the nature of their response, months at least, perhaps years. Organizing and sending personnel all the way out here is no mean feat. 
Well, if it works, it'll be worth it. Let's go with that. Perhaps there is hope after all. And now I entrust it to you. Good luck, and trust no one in the Acropolis district. No, I don't think that anyone's going to give me a chance to trust anyone. All right, let's walk out of here while well, let's run out of here before they start shooting, shall we? I mean, I wouldn't would enjoy killing them all, but. You know, we gotta have somebody alive around here. Alright, that's gonna be the end of this video. We're gonna go take on the corporate headquarters in the next one. Y'all stay safe and have a good one. Till next time, later.